Hi, my name is Priya Dar, and I'm the Fellowship Program Director at the Podesnack Family Division of Adolescent and Young Adult Medicine at Lurie Children's. I think that we are unique in that one, we're situated in Chicago, which um, if anybody knows Chicago knows that there's a lot of youth that need care here. So I think it positions us well to be a training site. We have a lot of specialized clinical programs. Um, our gender development program is you know, world renowned. We also have a substance use prevention program. And then our division is also developing a lot of other programs. We've recently started an inpatient consult service. We're developing a mental health program within our division and also increasing the amount of primary care patients that we're able to serve. So we're, we're in this phase of rapid growth, which means that clinical programs are just popping up, which gives fellows opportunities, not just to train in those programs, but also to learn how to develop a program. All of our fellows get to rotate through Howard Brown Health, which is one of the premier LGBTQ clinics that service Chicago um, and one of the oldest actually in the U.S. Um, and, you know, because we are in Chicago, we're at Lurie Children's, we also have a really robust research program and our division actually has several NIH grants that are really working to improve the lives of marginalized youth, not just in Chicago, but really around the globe. Our fellows get to be a part of advocacy and actually our fellows lead advocacy efforts and help, um, help our division uh, take advocacy further. Our fellows have published in the Washington Post um, and other journals for, um, you know, for all people that have wide readership. They also, um, you know, find what interests them within Chicago and, uh, you know, sort of pave their own path based on what their interests are with faculty support as well as the support of Lurie Children's. One thing that is really special about our program is that it is new, so it's developing. And what that means is that, um, you know, there's a lot of changes that are happening. My mission is to make sure that fellows are also always kept in the picture as our division is growing. We're really trying to center education in all of these programs. And because our division is so rapidly growing, it really means that we have a lot of opportunities and have open ears to listen to what trainees want as well. I think the type of person that would really thrive in our program is somebody who is really enthusiastic and comes in with an open mind and is excited about adolescent medicine. Thanks for listening. If you have any questions, please feel free to reach out and we look forward to hearing from you. Thank you.